What we got? All right, people. I am on my way to one of my local grocery stores again. I heard, I heard a rumor, a little tip, that they got some Blanton's Gold. So I haven't been to this spot in a minute, so I'm gonna go check it out anyway. So uh, we'll see, we'll get there. I'll get inside, I'll see what they got. If it's not out on the, uh, the shelf or in the glass case, I'll see what else they got anyway. But then I'll find someone and ask them and see if they got it, man. Hopefully, I hope it's true. I got sent on a, a little bit of a scavenger hunt or over to a mountain house, Safeway, for a Blanton's Gold, and if they didn't have it, but I did, I'm not complaining because I did walk out of there with a Elijah, not Elijah Craig, a E.H. Taylor single barrel, and they also had some small batch and regular Blanton's orphan barrel, uh, Eagle Rare. They had all that stuff too, so I'm not complaining. I did get an E.H. Taylor single barrel, so hopefully this is true. I think Blanton's is better over 100 proof. And it's, this is 103 proof, as uh, anyone that follows this stuff knows, that Blanton's Gold, 103 proof, is better than regular Blanton's. All right? All right, I'm going to go check it out. We're going to go see. All right, people. I'm out for a minute. All right, people. I'm here. I'm going in the store. We can see if this is true. I'm going to walk straight back there. See if it got on the shelf or in the glass case. So hopefully it'd be in the glass case if it got here. You know, hopefully someone's just not running up on it and grabbing it. You know, someone like me. <laughs> How you guys like this here? CF with that gold stash, right? CF is Curly Fried. Curly Fried. He is a friend of mine with a big old mustache out of Turlock. He's a barber out of Turlock. Go check him out, Curly Fried on Instagram, Curly Fried. Uh, go, go ahead and try to uh, Google it. If you want to do the haircut, go check him out. All right, we're almost back here. All right, here's the regular spot in here. Let's see what they got for the regular stuff here. Uh, same stuff looks uh, looks like. You know, the other Redwood Empire prices, we got that. What is that? That's a Handy's Old Fashioned. Oh, it's an Old Fashioned mix. Mm. The uh, bullet one's pretty good. I actually got it down uh, down to the left here, down on my left. These prices here, decent prices. Yeah, Knob Creek 9, 100 proof for 43.99. It's not bad. Redemption. You guys like this, uh, or I'm sorry, Templeton Rye? Anyone had that? I haven't had it at Templeton Rye. You know, this at least has come down a little bit. Normally I see that McKenna Ball and Bond for like 110 bucks. Crazy around here. Uh, at least at 70, 99 is a step in the right direction at least. We're supposed to have your Elijah Craig 12 year. They're supposed to have Elijah Craig 12 year, but they're, what? Oh, that's, I don't know, that can't be right. That can't be right. Anyway, uh, the rye, Elijah Craig rye, the bullets, all that stuff. That big old Pendleton for 46 bucks, not bad. Uh, here we go, regular stuff here, regular stuff. <laughs> Bonded is back, man. Not a fan, but it's back. If you like it, there you go. 35 bucks. Jefferson's small batch. What was that very small batch? Very small batch? Eh. Not a fan of that either. Got the old Bardstown. I heard that's junk too. Makers, you got the cast rank. That's good stuff. Uh, yeah. Same old stuff. What's this here? Oh, Dwarfs. Same old stuff here, though. You guys see the prices there been through this before 26.99 it's a little higher for a that's about seven or eight dollars higher than i can get it in this town here 101 rye it's a good ride man i gotta, I gotta say these uh these honeys are pretty good and i i like the tennessee fire but they're not like the uh, uh fireball good stuff that vanilla is not bad those aren't too bad right there for what they are uh, bird dog early times dickle there's the dickle people like that, it's about as much as I like the uh, Jack Daniels. Good stuff, good stuff. And we all, that, that one, that BDH Taylor uh, small batch out for me in a bald and bald blind. Anyway, I don't see it here. Let me go check the case here real quick. No, no. Got anything here? Uh, nothing really. Oh, there's that. Party. No, yes, so yes, small no. batch. 
John Party, John Party Small Batch 112. I haven't had it. I'm not interested in it unless someone that I trust says it's great. For some reason, I might give it a second look because about 61 bucks for something that's got a celebrity name, name on it. And I'm not doing that. Double look for 55, 56 bucks. Make those indie rye. Makers 46. Yeah, man, we got the wheel tossing I don't know anybody that likes that. Anyway, not in here. So I'm going to go uh, try to find somebody. Yeah, not in here. So I'm gonna go and try and find somebody, see if they got anything special locked up in the bag. So let's go check them out. Well, people, it happened. Right here. It was true. $139.99. A contact came through over here. $151 after tax. You get this thing right here. Huh? All right. Got this nice little black velvet bag right there. Yeah, baby. Never owned one of these, people. Never owned one of these. I don't even... I've had some before, but I've never owned one. So, yeah, baby. Yeah, we got that 103 proof right there. Yeah, and it's an N. Blanton's. We got one of the N's. Yep, right on. That's it, people. He came through one more time in my hometown local grocery store. All right, people. Score! Out.